Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name is Nora, and welcome to my channel. So as you guys read by the title below, today we're in Chicago, and we're here for the Sueños Festival. It's a two-day festival, and I'm so excited, we're all excited. My sister and my brother-in-law are here with me. It's 9.43, we've been up, well, I've been up since 7.30. Oh, look, I got this new case. It's so sparkly. Thank you. We ordered home service. So we got pancakes a coffee, an orange juice, an omelet. It's mostly reggaeton. So there's Wisin y Yandel, J Balvin, Osuna, Osuna, Osuna. Osuna. El, Alfa. el Alfa. That's who I'm most excited to see. I think El Alfa's tomorrow if I'm not mistaken. La mama de la mama de la mama. <laughs> who are you most excited to see? Wisin y Yandel, I think for you. Cause I, I mean, Wisin y Yandel are OGs. That's why we're really excited to see them. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jolie Randy, yeah. Jolie Randy. So we're finally ready. It's so cute, I love this color. So this is my day one outfit. Top is Shein, cargo pants are Shein. My Target boots, which have literally saved my life. They're so comfy. And yeah, that's my outfit. So this is Michael's day one outfit. Shirt is from Zoomies, I think. Hat is North Face, Ray-Bans, jeans are H&M. We're all wearing cargo pants, Vans, and these awesome earrings from Stilo J Balvin. <laughs> J Balvin who? <laughs> They're from Amazon. This shirt is Forever 21. Forever 21. Uh, pants are Shein, and then the shoes are Gianni Bini from Jones. Look how sparkly they are though. They're cute. So this is the view from our hotel. That is Grant Park where the festival is going on. Who's ready to ferrear? Look at the line. We thought it was over there, but that was VIP. Ooh, the fountain. This is the Buckingham Memorial Fountain. line literally the lines all the way over here but they have a bunch of they have quesadilla tacos la michoacana is here you have like healthy food adobo grill there's fish tacos they have this whole other side they have all the seating area which is nice all of that is more food let's try these tacos
So it's 11:44, and we got home like an hour ago. But I had to go into like Instagram and post stuff that I wanted to post, just because you know there's never signal. I'll put my Instagram right here so you can follow me. But I wanted to let you guys know how our first um, day one went. So I rated like a 10 out of 10. It was really like it was really good. Everybody there did an amazing job. Literally, El Alfa, amazing. Osuna, amazing. The worst part of it though, so Jolie and Randy were gonna be there. So Joel was there, but Randy wasn't because he missed his flight, allegedly. Joel did such a good job by himself. So Keisha, she was really good too. It was so much fun, we're so tired. We were standing in the same place for six hours. Eight hours. Oh, eight hours. Oh my God, we didn't move. So everybody kept coming and going and um, you guys will see in the video, I mean, there was like 50,000 people there, probably 50,000 plus. I don't even know how many people there were, but um, we didn't want to go and then try to get back in because we knew it was going to be really difficult. But we kept seeing people that were standing right next to us or in front of us go and then come back. I just didn't want to go through the hassle, honestly, because I wanted a drink. But I just didn't want to go out and then get back, try to get back in all the way kind of in the front. But tomorrow we're gonna, so we have like obviously general admission, but we want to go to the box office and ask if we could upgrade to a VIP because dude, VIP people look like they were having the time of their lives. Like oh, back here in general admission, we couldn't even, everybody was touching everybody. Everybody was like all breathing on me. I got sunburned, look, literally, oh my. <laughs> and on my shoulder. I'm gonna go shower, take my makeup off. We will see you guys tomorrow morning. So we came to the box office because yesterday, I think I told you guys, it was a hassle to, first of all, get in. The line was really long, you saw. And we were getting pushed and shoved by everybody. So we came and we upgraded to VIP. So there's a special line for VIP. You don't have to wait in the line. And 
we're more in the front, I'll show you guys. Oh, this is the entrance for the VIP. Okay, so now it's like two o'clock and we're finally ready. This is the look. So this is my day two outfit. This is from Shein. This star bra is from Shein. Pants are from Shein. I love this. Hopefully I'm not too hot. <laughs> and it has this, this is super cute. Uh, boots are the same ones from yesterday, Target. Same jewelry as yesterday. And I bought these, literally, literally their hair cuffs from Shein also. And yeah, that's my outfit. So this is my outfit of the day. And, um, earrings are from Forever 21. The shirt is from Shein. Pants are Shein. And then the shoes are Gianni Beanie from Dillard's. My outfit of the day. So yesterday I told you guys that the shirt he was wearing was from Zoomies, but this one's from Zoomies. The other one was from Rags Talk. Answer H and M, White Forces, North Face hat. Our first drink of the night, day. Cheers! I'm drinking a Bacardi Piña Colada. Hopefully this shit is good. Corona extra. Cheers!
que no discrimina a nadie, así que vamos a romper toda mi vida que se mueve. Mi ánimo como lo quiere, hago música que te quiere. El mundo nos quiere, nos quiere y me queda a mí toda mi vida que se mueve. Mi ánimo como lo quiere, hago música que te quiere. Mi música lo quiere. Everybody conmigo, yo, yo, yo. Jay Cortez. 
AKA Jacob. Jacob yeah, Jacob did a really, really good job. Yeah, his outfit was really, really cool. Like, his outfit was cool. The inter he didn't really interact that much with the audience, though. But his performance but, is like Yeah, but his lit. performance is really good. Jay Balvin, he closed Jay out Balvin. the show. Jay Balvin did a really good job. I wish he would have interacted more with the crowd. I'm still comparing him to Osuna, and I liked Osuna better than Jay Balvin. Yeah, but also like the fact that Jay Balvin took the time, like someone threw their shoe, and a sharpie and he took the time to like sign their their shoe he took the time to do like that speech that said like thank you um, yeah, nobody, be nice to each just, other people were just like get off stage and not even whatever. yeah he did that and then eventually he just kind of walked off his performers were really like his dancers between day one and two i i like the performers more on day one but the whole situation of like being in general admission was yeah, terrible it was, it was terrible so that's that why I liked it. yesterday better. Day two was better because I mean we were still kind of in that crowd, but we had that like space to like you go, to come and go, away. come and yeah. go. You don't have to go the to the bathrooms work. were super close. Yeah, the bathrooms were amazing. They were so close and they were cleaner too than the dinner admission bathrooms. <laughs> Overall it was an amazing weekend. There were no Michael. fights. Michael, what day did you like the best? So I really hope that they have this festival next year because we're definitely going to be attending. Yeah, we're going to get the platinum. We're going to get the platinum. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment and down below. Comment down below which outfit you like the best. Comment down below which performance from the video you yeah, thought was you, the best. Yeah, you guys like the best. And also, we had a discussion. If they did this again next year, who would be good for them to bring? Like, we were trying to think of people, so, you know. Let us know. Below who you think that they should bring next year. I will see you guys in my next video.